Hello friends, today we'll talk about URL rewriting in ASP.NET. Um, I have created one page for URL rewriting purposes that simply passes in a invalid URL to the browser um, and uh, we'll see how to make that actually rewrite into a valid page. So first I'm going to quickly do a view in browser just to see how it would look and of course if I click on it it will give us a 404 not found error now we can do this two different ways I prefer using the global.asax which gives you a whole lot more control over how you rewrite the URLs versus webconfig which kind of limits you to what you can do so um, that's the the sample we're going to be using today so I'm gonna quickly open up the global.asax this is the code that comes up by default I added this code in. Um, now this fires at the beginning of each request. So I only want to use it when I am handling the profile page rewrite. So anything that starts with a slash profile, I'm getting the full URL, I'm seeing if it actually matches. And if it does, I'm gonna rewrite it to the user details.aspx page and on the user details.aspx page, I'm simply showing whatever was passed in as a query to that page. Um, so we'll go ahead and give that a shot now. I'm gonna quickly recompile. Control Shift P is the keyboard shortcut for it. Now, when I go back to this page, if I hit refresh now, it should load the page with that information. Now, if you notice something on the source code for this page, However, it actually shows the URL we did versus showing the URL that you see on the browser. Now, that's really important for SEO purposes. And the way to get around that is you go to the code behind and the keyboard shortcut for that is F7. And in here, you simply do form one dot action equals request dot raw URL and that will make it, uh, let's just rebuild real quick, and that should give us the updated URL, which is what you're seeing on the browser. Now, that's how you go ahead and make it URL rewrite across the board using global.asax in ASP.NET. Hope this helps. Hit me up if you have any questions. Thank you.